It's just a copy of a didgeridoo. Now the Aborigines, who are the, the natives of Australia, would walk through the forest in certain parts of Australia, and it's a big place, and they would find a dead uh, stringy bark tree, which is a member of the eucalyptus family, and they'd pick it up and they would tap on it, and if it was hollow, they would know that it might make a good instrument because the insides of the stringy bark tree are soft, and termites would come and they'd eat that out. And so the Aborigine would, would cut off the length of one and take it back to his village, and then he'd build a fire, put the end of hardwood stick in the fire and get it red hot and start gradually poking it in and cleaning it out the rest of the way. And Ida Orange, Ida has a dog named Orange. <laughs> and now the chorus goes, Ida Red, Ida Red, love a girl named Ida Red. So everybody sing that with me. Ida Red, Ida Red, love a girl named Ida Red. Now get ready to play, here we go. Five, five, five. Bye, 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 bye,